Hello everyone, welcome back and welcome to another video here on this channel. Today we're talking about the new weapon, the Howler, which will soon be released with an energy capacity requirement of 12 and 16. What's this weapon all about and what can it do? You'll find out after the intro. Recently, Plarium seems to be focusing heavily on close-range weapons, and today we have another one in that category, the Howler. This weapon fires a kind of sonic wave that deals massive damage upon hitting its target. The Howler has a magazine capacity of four shots and takes 5.7 seconds to reload. Its optimal range is between 15 and 19 meters, depending on its rank, and its maximum range is between 30 and 39 meters, also depending on its rank. The Howler 12 deals between 15,196 and 93,144 damage, while the Howler 16 deals between 2,396 and 124,200 damage. Like most close-range weapons, the Howler is relatively easy to handle, so it requires little to no practice to use effectively. However, you should keep its low magazine capacity in mind. Ignoring this could easily put you in a very unfavorable situation from which you might not come out alive. But how does the Howler compare to other close-range weapons? The answer is, not particularly well. It's on a similar level to the Fragment Gun or the Repeater. The biggest drawback of the Howler is its low magazine capacity and long reload time. Of course, the damage is decent, but when compared to other close-range weapons like the Ember Gun or the Revoker, the Howler falls short. The weapon is therefore most effective in the early and mid-game. In the end game, I can only see it working well on Nomad or Seeker. The Howler 16 might work well in combination with Mimicker, but that's about it. If you like the playstyle or don't yet have an Ember Gun or Revoker, I can recommend the Howler with some reservations. However, it's not a must-have. But what do you think of the Howler? Let me know in the comments. We'll see you in another video, and until then, take care.